Hi there, everybody. I'm Angie, your friendly neighborhood dietitian with the Oxford County Community Health Center. And we are interviewing a few of our uh, regular staff just so you get to know us a little bit differently. And today it's my pleasure to be able to interview Dr. Hamilton. Um, there's a few questions that we've set up and he knows what the uh, answers are going to be and then I'm going to surprise him a little bit as well. Um, Dr. Hamilton, just give us an idea. How long have you been here at the center? Hi everyone. Um, so I've been a doctor with the Oxford County Community Health Center since almost the beginning, so uh, late in 2010. Ten years. Yes. Yep. And so as much as people know what, what doctors do when they're in the room with you, so there doesn't need to be a whole lot of uh, discussion about that, but I wonder if you can give people an idea of behind the scenes, what keeps you busy during the day, other than just being able to see clients? Uh, absolutely, Angie, great question. Uh, so obviously I love to uh, be able to interact with patients and uh, but not able to do that as much as, as people might like. Behind the scenes, often uh, might be dealing with uh, folks might have uh, paperwork that they need completed, so applications for different services or healthcare needs um, locally or in the community. Um, as well, we are a team-based uh, organization, so uh, not only might you see me, but you might see uh, our nurses, our nurse practitioners, our dietitian. Uh, amongst others in the team. So uh, we do collaborate and we are team based. So we do like uh, to meet with one another, uh, review uh, complex situations and uh, discuss within a team how we might best help people. Uh, so it's, it's an opportunity for me to share my knowledge with others, but also for me to learn from other people in the, in the practice uh, at the health center. Uh, so overall, we hope that it provides good quality care for everyone. Uh, even if you're not able to get in to see us uh, as quickly as you might like. It, it does sound like you were um, maybe drawn to a community health center more so than a traditional doctor's office for that reason, like the, the collaboration in between um, different professions. Is there other things that kind of made you choose this over anything else? Uh, definitely, I love the uh, the setup of the community health center. So when I when I started in 2010, I was a new graduate coming to a new uh, city, and the opportunity to work within a group setting where I uh, had some internal um, sources uh, to take advantage of in the beginning, and uh, and being able to work with a a group of uh, patients that, that really needed uh, the type of care that we can provide from the community health center was, was a big attraction. Uh, since, since I've started, we've really expanded the amount of services available um, from when we started in a, uh, the old TD uh, bank down on Dundas uh, in Light Street area. And now we've expanded over to the Metcalf. Um, now we're offering much more services, which is fantastic for not only our primary care patients, but also for the community in general to access all of our programs uh, that you can utilize here. Yeah, we've expanded a lot. I remember, I think there was like sure. 12 of us and now there's well over 25. Um, just on a personal note then, if you could give us anything that you might like to share that gives us an idea about who you are and what you like to do, but um, that we wouldn't know about you. Sure, so um, obviously uh, being a doctor uh, keeps me quite busy. Uh, a little fun fact about myself was uh, when I was younger, was quite um, adept at uh, five-pin bowling. So I actually uh, represented Southwestern Ontario at the age of uh, around 10 years old um, at the national championships for five pin bowling. So that was out in Calgary, um, Alberta, soon after I think the uh, the Olympics actually were, were run in the winter there. So that's a little fun tidbit about uh, Dr. Hamilton that you probably didn't know. And almost an Olympian is what you essentially said. Basically, um, bet between you and us, I'll say, yeah, I, I, I was in the Olympics, sure. Sounds good. Thanks, Dr. Hamilton. Not a problem.
Thanks, Angie.